in a marked change to the battering from the first day's weather onslaught, it was champagne sailing for the AC45 team's day two fleet racing. It looks pretty close to the line. China's looking good. Yeah, China has a clean start, I think, and accelerates well. Brilliant start from Fred Lepetrek. Fascinating how fast these boats accelerate in very light wind. Look at Team New Zealand take off. Okay, we see that uh, China team was just a little early, so they're going to have to take a penalty, which means they slow down for two boat lengths before they can resume racing again. Luna Rossa, they've also got a penalty. And, of course, New Zealand come out clean again. Emirates around first. Oh, we've got one of the Korean guys nearly slipped off the boat through that tack. Oracle Racing Bundok is sixth. Oracle Racing Spithill surprisingly back in seventh. Great shots. The boat's just, just inches apart. Enormous lead here. New Zealand's just stretched way out in front. Two, one, here we go. Driving. Great result. Great yeah. result for Team New Zealand. Yeah, the the way, An way. exemplary yeah. performance by Emirates Team New Zealand, but local hopes Luna Rossa Piranha arrive on the podium in second. This is the start of the next race. China team very close to that line once again. Yeah, it looked very close. And I'd expect to see a couple of OCSs there, or early starters. Team Korea on the course side has to drop back. They were early, Team Korea. You can see some of the boats had to slow there, take their penalties, and that opens the door for the guys next to them to sail away in the clean air. They're really uh, outstanding characteristics that they unfurl that sail and get that Jenica flying very, very quickly. Nice shot of New Zealand coming around the mark. New Zealand way in the distance there. They've extended away from the rest of the fleet again to Luna Ross's in pursuit, but looks like uh, Team New Zealand's getting it, getting it easy again, this one. Fully deserved it. There was absolutely fantastic crew coordination, great positioning, minimizing the tax. A great win for Emirates Team New Zealand. So Luna Rossa, Piranha and Swordfish show their form. And the standings after day two, Emirates Team New Zealand lead. Oracle Spittle cling on to second, with Italy moving up to third with Team Korea.